Hello! In this project we are going to learn how to use the ESP now to connect two ESP boards and send the data between them. You are going to see how easy it is to send the data between any ESP boards. In this example we are going to send the temperature and humidity data from ESP32 to Note MCU and display it on the OLED display. This project is brought to you by PCBWay. What I really like about them is that you can get 10 professional made boards for around $5, which is really amazing for professionally made boards. On their website just click on the get instant quote and you will see how much the PCB will cost. They also offer other services like PCB assembly, 3D printing, CNC machining. The link will be in the description, so go and check them out. For this project you will need two ESP boards. In our case it is Note MCU board and ESP32. OLED display, DHT11 temperature and humidity sensor, some jumper wires, breadboard and Visuino program. Wire everything according to this schematic. Go to website and download and install Visuino program. First we need to get a MAC address for each board. To do that open Visuino and select the Note MCU board. We are first going to get the MAC address for the Note MCU. Connect pin MAC address to serial pin 0. At the bottom click on the build tab and make sure that you selected the right port and board and click compile build and upload button. Now click on the serial tab and click connect button and you should see the MAC address. In case you don't see it just click on the reset button on the board and it will pop up. Copy the address to your notepad. Now we are going to do the same process for the ESP32 board. Open new Visuino and select ESP32 board depending on your board. In my case it is ESP32 development board. Connect pin MAC address to serial pin 0. At the bottom click on the build tab and make sure that you selected the right port and board and click compile build and upload button. Now do the same, click on the serial tab and click connect button and copy the MAC address to your notepad. Now that we have the addresses, we can start working on the project. For start we are going to make a sender with ESP32 and it will send the data to Note MCU board. Start new Visuino and select your board. In my case it is ESP32 development board. Select the board and in the properties expand modules, Wi-Fi, ESP now and click on the elements three dots button. In the elements window drag device peer to the left side and from the notepad copy the node MCU MAC address to the properties window. Now close the elements window 
at DHT11 sensor component. Add analog to analog array component. Select analog to analog array 1 and in the properties window set input pins to 2. and add packet component double click on the packet 1 and in the elements window drag analog array to the left side and close the elements window Connect humidity thermometer 1 pin sensor to ESP32 board pin 5. And connect pin temperature to analog to analog array 1 pin 0. And connect pin humidity to analog to analog array 1 pin 1 connect analog to analog array 1 pin out to packet 1 analog array 1 pin in and connect packet 1 pin out to ESP32 board pin sending in At the bottom click on the build tab and make sure that you selected the right ported board and click compile build and upload button. Now we are going to make the receiver with the Note MCU board that will display the temperature and humidity on the OLED display. Start new Visuino and select Note MCU board. Select the board and in the properties expand modules, Wi-Fi, ESP now and click on the elements three dots button. In the elements window drag device peer to the left side. And from the notepad copy the ESP32 MAC address. And close the elements window. Add unpacket component. Double click on the unpacket one and in the elements window drag analog array to the left side. and close the elements window add analog array to analog component select analog array to analog 1 and in the properties window set output pins to 2 add OLED I2C component double click on the display OLED 1 
and in the elements window drag draw text to the left side and in the properties window set text to temperature and size to 2. Now in the elements window drag text field to the left side and in the properties window set size to 2 and x to 65. Now drag another draw text to the left side and in the properties window set size to 2, text to humidity and y to 40. Add another text field to the left side and in the properties window set size to 2, x to 65 and y to 40. Now close the elements window. Connect pin received out to unpacket 1, pin in and connect unpacket 1, analog array 1, pin out to analog array to analog 1, pin in, connect analog array to analog 1, pin 0, to display OLED 1, pin text field 1, pin in and connect pin 1 to text field 2, pin in, now connect display OLED 1, pin I2C out, to the board, pin I2C, pin in. At the bottom click on the build tab and make sure that you selected the right ported board and click compile built and upload button.